BJP gets a new office bearers. The party uh, gets new BJP uh, general secretaries. Uh, Bandi Sanjay has been appointed as the BJP general secretary. This is a rejig happening in the BJP ahead of uh, 2024 Lok Sabha elections. My colleague Mohit joins us on the phone line to help us with more details. Mohit, a uh, rejig has taken place in the BJP just ahead of the 2024 Lok Sabha elections. The BJP gets new office bearers, new uh, general secretaries. Bandi Sanjay appointed as the BJP general secretary. Give us more details on the significance of uh, this move. Well, as of now, uh, the new list of the BJP office bearers has come out. In addition to the old list, we see that new names have been added. And one of the significant names over here is of Sanjay Bandi, who is uh, the MP uh, from Telangana. He is the former chief of Telangana in the BJP. And we know for a fact that how uh, it was being said that where exactly Sanjay Bandi would be accommodated. He is said to be the face of the BJP over there. And he has been accommodated at the centre. He has been given a very important post of the National General Secretary uh, at the, at the, at the centre. And we know for a fact that how Telangana elections are just around the corner and Hence, it will be very, very important. It will be very, very important uh, to have Sanjay Bandi at the center, at the hands of, of the affairs. And now also, Radha Mohan Agarwal is also the general secretary, has been made the general secretary of BJP. Another uh, one more important development is A.K. Anthony. The, uh, Amin Anthony, I beg your pardon, son of A.K. Anthony, who just joined the BJP, has been made the national secretary. And he comes from Kerala. And Kerala is another state where BJP is trying to make inroads. And hence, it's also a very, very significant development that Anil Anthony has been made the secretary, uh, uh, a national secretary rather, and he comes from the state of Kerala.